We are on Demo 93, but interestingly, these have now been rebranded to Euro Demo Future 93. Uh, why specifically? I'm not sure. I've just been told that there is a reason for it. So, <laughs> I think rebranding generally. Um, but yeah, I'm seeing, uh, I'm seeing a bunch of Disney in here, and also Dancing Stage Party Edition that might, might need to either be muted or immediately uh, taken us out of. Um, but at this point, there's so many demos that are going to contain the same game. We are just going to only play the demo if it's actually something drastically new. Um, otherwise, we're going to just move out and move on. Because we'll be here forever otherwise. Um, waiting for you. If, thank you. I'm, I'm waiting for me too. Um, is it the same piece of music? Uh, let's just find out. I'm playing as Boldo. Is it the same songs? It's the same songs, baby! Uh, and I'm not on, and I wasn't on the emulator, so I need to reset. There we go. There we go, cool. I didn't make a save stakes, so I wasn't on the emulator. We've played this, but is it new? That's the question on our minds. Um, it probably is not. Ooh, actually, it might be. I don't think we did Kenya last time. Kenya is new, sweet, all right, let's go. Lovely stuff. Let's drive around Kenya. It actually, it looks very nice. Let's, uh, let's go. 90% gravel, 10% sand. That That's a lot less sand than I expected. Thought there'd be a lot more, but fair enough. Oh, let's go. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready to do it. Ready to go. Ready to win. Ready to fail. I'm bad on, on actual dirt surfaces. So let's see how it goes. This is this is gonna feel really really loose, isn't it? Whoa! Yeah, really loose does not really explain it. Okay. <laughs> wow. Impressive. Yeah. This, oh my gosh. Oh my god. Oh, I'm not gonna do well here. Okay. I would you believe me if I said I'm trying my best? <laughs> it may not look it, but I am trying. <laughs> very, long, easy left. <laughs> very long easy left. I don't know why that amuses me, it just does. Um, oy yeah, I guess like the sand elements of it just isn't really on the track itself. There's a, there is a lot of sand, but more off off the track, um, where, where the track has been built. But actually, yeah, that's a very cool track. Open what? Oh, open heaven. <laughs> it's like, open what now? <laughs> I didn't. I didn't hear hear the words. Oh, there's like a person on a bridge up there. That's a nice attention to detail. Given that you're going quite fast and they're really, really high up, you can't really see them. I'd kind of love to see what the model looks like because I bet it is just like, just the most, the most basic stick of a person. Like just because like <laughs> you're never gonna be able to see them up close, like, even if you try. So it'd be quite funny to see them in that regard. Um, is this like in a uh, Spider-Man, like Marvel Spider-Man, like when you look at the people out to the boats in the the first Spider-Man, and they're just like horrible, cursed PS1 models because you're not really supposed to see them. Um, but like that that kind of thing's always very amusing. Ooh. I mean, the way I'm driving, I would be dead. But uh, thankfully, this is a game, and I'm fine. <laughs> We are, we are, we are grateful that I can't drive in real life. Oh God, I'm sorry. Yeah, also, luckily, a small flimsy piece of tape is the hardest substance known to man. So, uh, that will protect me from certain doom. Um, and create a different type of certain doom. It's quite fun though. Yeah, I'm not very good at these games. Um, I just, I'm just not very good at driving on dirt surfaces, but I think that's the point, like, it's not something you just, if you haven't played them, it's not something you just naturally am like, oh yeah, yeah, I can, I can do this flawlessly. It takes time to adjust to how to drive, and I mean, every racing game also is very different from each other, so, yeah. New record time, it wasn't a good one, but, but I appreciated it, and it was cool, so thank you very much. Uh, Treasure Planet! Back, uh, back to, um, Treasure Planet. Is it going to be a different level, or is it going to be the same? 
Uh, let's find out. Um, I think this is the same. Uh, it's looking like it. Yes, it is. Okay, yeah, it's the same though, I'm fan of. Oh, no. Before, it just had the term sea monkeys, and now it's got the amazing virtual sea monkeys. Because it, it needed needed the word amazing to really sell it. Um, I am terrified. Yeah, I, uh, I had a nap later that day, and I did see it. I saw it in my nightmares, lingering over my bed. With its piercing eyes. Yep, there it is. Yep, no, it, it's... The, the little fish down below as well, it's great. The octopus is strangely the most normal thing there. I hate it so, so much. Um, I'm assuming it is the same game. Level one, yeah, it's the same game. All right, cool, good, never playing it again. Stupid little two. Um, I presume the same demo, but it might have music this time. It does have music. Still has a time limit, but it has music. Good for you, demo. You, you are slightly better. I think this is the music we heard in the trailer. The one that sounds very Toy Story Racer-like. Yes, that one. Oh, oh actually, yes, yeah, the voice acting. No. Fair enough. All right. Well, we have played this demo, so we will move on. Um, Rayman Rush. So, funny thing about Rayman Rush. I've played Rayman M, which is the PS2 version. I've never played Rush. Which came out after M, so I think it's like a downport to PS1, which is interesting. So it will be intriguing to see what this game is like. And yeah, the, the character in the loading screen, not the pirate, is... I can't remember her name, but it's like Lee's cousin, who's only in this game. But the, uh, the music in the PS2 version is real good. Uh, as is uh, as are the tracks, so it'll be interesting to see. Uh, have I played the Rayman Brain games? No. Um, Emil and I intended to do one a couple years back. We just never did. It's triangle like yeah yeah triangle gives you an extra dash if you if you press triangle. Okay, so Rayman's theme is still here, which is cool. Okay. So this music is the same. Do you get... A, yeah, you get a little boost if you press triangle when you land as well. Cool. I don't... I, I guess collecting lums is a thing you need to do. Um, I don't believe it was a thing in the original game. Whoops, I probably want to go that way. Um, but yeah, it's interesting. Like, this track has similarities to the PS2 version. But, like, it's also different. It's it's very strange. Like same with same with the same with the music. Like there's there's bits of the music which is the same or very similar, but it's not all the same. Oh, what you're only giving me one lap, really? You're not giving me a whole race? No, no game. No, surely not. Gutted. What do you mean? What does demo mean? I mean a minute. So what's what's the difference between single player and demo? Oh, it's gonna be like a trailer, right? Yes, it's gonna be. It is going to be a trailer or watching someone do it, someone badly play it. I think this track was new and exclusive for the PS One. Like, I'd, I'd honestly, I'd need to play them side by side because I know that the PS Two version had a bunch of levels that were unique to PS2, and I think PS1 had the same, and it might be in its final world? Um, good. Rayman. Please, Rayman, you, you had you had a chance, and you, you, you squandered it. But the music in this game is legitimately very good. Is Rayman going to come back and somehow win? Not likely. Not le even less likely. <laughs> If Rayman does come back, it's gonna be the save of the century. Oh, actually, he is. Like, if Glowbox is stupid enough to, like, waste a bunch of time. Come on, come on, Rayman. Come on, you got this. 
Go fast. No, you're, you're screwed. Yeah. Alright. Well, that was fun. Peter Pan! I can't... Yeah, we, we did play this in a demo, didn't we? We did the first level. Um, and the game looks pretty cool. Um... I'm, I'm intrigued to play it, but I will play it at some point because I'm going to be continuing the Disney Preservation series. So don't you worry, I will get to it. Um, it will happen. Um, yes, I believe this is the first level. Oh, actually, is it? Oh, you know what, I'm not sure. Maybe it's not, maybe it's a different level. Oh, maybe it is a different level. Alright. Yes, it is different. I killed a bird. Peter Pan is a menace. I mean, to be fair, I've always hated Peter Pan. <laughs> like, like, truly despise it. Oh, okay. Violent. Um, and, uh, once upon a time, uh, like a show, uh, that, like, covers fairy tales in a different light, uh, has Pan as a villain. Uh, which is entirely justified. Um, it's, it's handled very well. I really like it. But yeah, it's uh, it's just it's just saying what I've always thought. Um, I hate the character. Um, movie's fine. Movie movie's great. Like I mean, I just I think Peter Pan's an asshole. <laughs> which is an accurate approximation of what he is. You found a secret place. Um, I haven't seen the movie in a while, admittedly, but, uh, I do remember it being a lot of fun. Um. In the original book, it's implied he kills the kids that want to leave the Netherland. Is it now? Again, does not surprise me. <laughs> he, he is an asshole. <laughs> I love the piranha, it's actually kind of cute. Oi, hello. It's actually kind of like... Almost, uh, Rayman-esque piranha. Cuter than a Rayman piranha, but still kind of Rayman-esque. Um, but yeah, no, I, I quite like the game. I, I've, I've made it no secret in my many, many years of making videos for I love verticality in games. Is that a level? Oh, what? That was such a short level! No! Oh, what? The first level was way longer! No, I really enjoyed that! No! Oh, man, it's so fun! If that's actually the end of the level in the main game, that's a really short, surprising level. But man, I like... Yeah, I just... I like... I like... That's a horrifying face. Uh, I really like verticality games. That's it. That's... That's... That, that's it. That's, that's verticality. I'm assuming this is the same demo we've played. Um, but I'll double check. It might not be. It almost certainly is. It sure is. Alright, cool. Um, Disney's Lilo and Stitch. Is it the same demo we played? There's a time limit that we're gonna have to adhere to Lilo's hat. Yeah, I think it's gonna be the same demo. Um, I'll double check. Like, I'll go to the level. Yeah, it's the same level. Alright, cool. Fair enough. Firebox! Um, is it the same demo we played before? It probably is. Uh, oh wait, no, this is different. This is a different level. Yeah, we did Victoria Mines. Let's do Sky Seer Complex, which sounds way harder. Um, let's go. Is it gonna be copyright music again? Probably. Two, 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 go! Yeah, no, this game's alright. It's it's certainly interesting. I don't mind it. Ooh, it doesn't want to turn as much as I would hope, but that's fine. Well, the music is different. Whoa. Whoa! Whoa, that quake was awesome. I'm so glad I had a shield. That was rad. You love to see it. Yeah, you've got some cool weapons. Oh, where do you guys come from? These guys just sort of teleported in. I did not I did not agree to this. Yeah, no, this uh this game's pretty fun. I quite like it. Oh man, that was a fast lap. Yeah, like the the game does feel fun to play. It's uh it's a little basic in its track design here and there, but like it is fun. I do appreciate it. I'm getting a 
ton of lucky uh, well, speed boosts. Thank you very much for the follow. Whoa, where did you come from? I'm still first though. So I don't think they were overtaking me. I think it was like a missile. Um, but yes. Do you remember when I was going really fast? Yeah, that, that speed is now ending. The, uh, the speed train ceases to be now. But I am very far ahead. In fact, I'm kind of close to overlapping someone. If you give me a couple more speed boosts, I might just get it. I, I would love to overlap someone. It would be pretty satisfying, I must say. Uh, I am getting there. Whoa, I'm upside down now. Woo! Uh, well, the overlapping train has ended because I got a bit confused there. But hey, you know what? There was someone just ahead of me. I, I was getting to them. That was a that was a domination, is what that was. That was pretty good. But uh, Kiro, thank you very much for the follow. Yeah, that was that was fun. I enjoyed that. Um, Formula One arcade. Now, is it going to break this time, or is it going to work? Uh, let's try it again. So we got USA. Last time we could not move. We've been watching my channel since the medieval remake. Oh wow. Well, thank you very much. Uh, that so that's how you discovered me. Oh, that's that's quite an obscure one. But thank you, thank you. I, I'm. Glad you've stuck around. Um, welcome. Hope you uh, hope you have a wonderful time in the stream. Nope, we will not be moving. It's such a such a weird glitch. But like, it just you can't move in this demo. Why? I don't know. Like, I have literally no idea. Um, it's so bizarre. Um, but yeah, that, that's this demo, I guess, because uh, we're kind of kind of forced to go away. So uh, fair enough. Um, 93, we enjoyed you, you were fun, we move on to Pastures New with 94. Um, ah, Conley Wars Red Sun, now we have played this before, so I'm assuming it's gonna be the same. Um, probably. Uh, Escort or Defense, I mean, sure, I mean. Yeah, I don't know why no one is moving, it's so bizarre, it's so, so bizarre. Yes, we have done this game. I was just gonna say, I'm pretty sure we have. Yeah, we have. Um, I like the music, not for me because I'm bad at it. Um, what's in the downloader? We got, oh, Devil Dice. Oh yeah, Devil Dice is cool. Um, I guess the question is what's in Devil Dice? What do you get? A hundred puzzle stages unlocked. That's actually a pretty good save file. I respect that. Um, Final Fantasy VIII, hopefully it doesn't spoil anything. It does not, that's good. I'm sure they wouldn't. Grand Theft Auto, all cars or something. All the licenses and gold and all the circuits available on Grand Theft Auto. Again, that's pretty good. That's a pretty good secret to have. Um, it's my never dies. Just, just it just never dies. Um, and it will reinforce that fact for you. Um, so yeah, fair enough. Downloadable stuff here. Hugo, the evil mirror. So we've played a Hugo game before. What was it called? It was called Black Diamond or something. No, it was Hugo Black Diamond or Hugo Black something because I thought Hugo Black was a person. Um, and then I was like, oh, right, Hugo is the name of the person. And the, the, but yes, um, but yeah, this is a different game. Um, I'm intrigued. The last one was... Uh, I'm intrigued to play more of it maybe one day just to see what it's like. But then again, maybe not if this far surpasses mirror, it. Mirror on the wall. Oh my god. Ooh. <laughs> okay. Interesting. As with all the games that we have Oh wow, this is actually like a developer like trailer. Oh this is cool. Now you should get behind this inside the great book of troll stories. A book that contains all the earlier adventures of Hugo. And uh, hmm. it's quite a good source of inspiration. <laughs> I mean, the animations actually aren't bad. It's uh, it is much, much better than the uh, the previous one. It is the game designer's job to create a gameplay that fits the story and the atmosphere, and it's the game designer's job to create tracks and characters and obstacles that Hugo will meet in the game. I love stuff like this, like early dev videos. Is it's quite rare to see, so when you do get them, it's actually really, really wonderful. <laughs> The game designer hands it over to the uh, art director. Mm. Mm. Uh, then I will try to uh, 
translate That's this cool. description into a, a graphic style in which we'll oh, the Hugo games have never played it. Well, that's fair. Um, I'm uh, well. Hopefully, this game will be in the game, like in one of the future demos, as an actual playable thing. Because I'm going to assume it's not going to give us a playable version immediately after this, but maybe it will. I'm enjoying Boss Squirrel. It's pretty good. <laughs> Mob nuts. Oh my god. I, okay, the animation's actually pretty great. The enemies and the obstacles for the game. It's pretty cool. This is so cool. When I love it. Absolutely love it. Start by creating a basic mesh. And we'll give it textures and assign light to it. Hmm. I'm intrigued to actually see gameplay now. I don't know really much about Hugo. Like, I just know Hugo exists. <laughs> like, that's not a lot to go off, though. It's very important that the obstacles and enemies react in the right way at the right time. Oh! Oh, wow, this looks so much better than the previous game. Wow! Wow, it's got like even it's like even mini game or mini game levels like it's there's actually so much more going on than the previous one. Oh wow, there's so much more going on. The previous one was so bland and empty. Oh wow, this is a crazy like advance. Fair play. Oh, it's kind of like a crash game. Interesting. Interesting. It's a crash clone. That is interesting, okay. I actually really want to play this now. I, I want to see... Oh, I also, I want to play both of them back to back and be like, okay, this is what they did before and then this is what they did like two years later and we're like, whoa, what a difference. I mean, I guess the first game did well enough that it justified a sequel. Or Hugo's, uh, like, as a character, was so popular that it justified it. I hope I'm not spoiling a nice family movie. What is that green Psyduck behind her? <laughs> what is this? You know you're not welcome. Dead. <laughs> okay. I mean, if you just use the normal mirror, he'd be dead. But then, now you just trapped him for a couple of years. Oh, she does look a bit like the lady from over the hedge! <laughs> Amazing. Oh, ballsy, but you don't really play as Hugo much in a Hugo game. You play mostly as Hugo's girlfriend or wife or sister or something. What the hell is that thing? Like, awful... DKC, like, Kremlin, but it just looks awful. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, no, I mean, not getting killed by the, in Pumpkin Gorge is, uh, is very impressive. It's a hard level. Um, I'm glad, uh, I'm glad you enjoyed, uh, the playthrough and I'm glad it helped. Now all that's left is to animate the sequences. <laughs> this is so cool because it's, like, showing the full process. Like, people don't do this enough. It's awesome. Especially for games. I mean, especially this early on. This is what, 2001, maybe maybe early too? Are you not going to go after your child who was like killing we themselves? Have quite a few new characters <laughs> that spend their time making it difficult for Reed, Red, and Root to find and assemble the mirror fragments. Stop there! I have a very important message for the Emperor. Yeah. <laughs> In the game, I make all my own stunts. Also, like, they've done full animated, like, cutscenes for the trailer, seemingly. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Like, they've, they've put so much effort into this, it's awesome. 
kind of love this. Oh my god. If there's a happy end, <laughs> well that's for the players to see too. I really, really, really respect this. All of you are awesome. That is fantastic. I really want to play the game now. That honestly, one of the best trailers I've seen in any of these demos. That that was awesome. Like that's that's how you win me over, specifically me. Whether it worked on any kid back in the day, probably not. Uh, but still, it was rad. Boogie Wonderland Result 1. What do you mean, Result 1? So, are we gonna see people just playing DDR well? Oh, we're gonna- we're gonna see- We're gonna see people actually play. Oh my god, we're- Oh my god, we're gonna see people who are like- So this is- Her name was Amy, right? Is that what it said her name was? So she's here, she's like, mm, I can't tell from the back of her head, maybe like 14 to 16? So now she's like, like late 30s? No, maybe, yeah, late 30s? Like, this is so weird! Like, this is a, this is a time capsule! Like, oh my god. This is so, but like, the, the, <laughs> I wonder if she knows that she won. And presumably they like presumably the winners get something besides being on PlayStation magazine. Also, they have more than one camera angle. Did they did they like message the winner and be like, oh can we film inside your house and see you play the game? And also you can't really see the TV. So you can't tell how well she's actually doing. This is so weird! <laughs> like, like, that, oh, that's, oh, man. These are such a window into the early 2000s. But yeah, these these people are in their late 30s now. That's, oh, my God. Maybe even, like, I mean, depending on, like, God, God forbid, some of them, knock on wood, might be dead. Like, it, it's possible. It's been 20 plus years. It, it's so crazy. Like, is it just me? Is it just me who feels that way? Because, like, I just... Oh, man. Oh, man. This is... This is absolutely nuts. Wow. Alright. Well, what's V-Rally 2? Have I played this one? I don't know. I don't recall. Okay. Am I gonna get a flatline as I crash into a wall? One. Oh, I think I have played this. Yeah, this looks familiar. Yeah, yeah, yeah I've 100% played this. Yeah. Will we will we hear a flatline sound effect when I crash? I will go as far as crashing. If I play perfectly, then well, I guess uh, I guess I'm a god, aren't I? I like how the uh, the thing like descends into the background. It's kind of kind of neat. I mean, it's just like, it's just fading through like a clipped part of the, the stage, like the, the screen, but I kind of like it. It's, it's different for the time. I'm actually playing really well for some reason. I don't know why I'm playing well. Yeah, this, this feels a lot better than the other game. The other, uh, the, uh, the other rally game didn't feel as tight as this. This feels really nice to play. And it's not just because I'm on a road surface. Like, I remember this game being pretty good. Um, yeah, I like how I was like, I'll go until I crash, and then just proceeds to not crash and plays the best I've ever played at this demo, even though I haven't played it in, like, eight months. Yeah, like, this game just feels really good to turn. If I turn, the car will turn. Like, it just... It feels like I'm in complete control. Even if I, like, go in a bit too hard. Um, like I did there. But yeah, like, this this game does feel really genuinely quite good. So massive respect to it, I guess. I don't know, admittedly, whether I'm actually doing well. 
Like, I, I've, I'm, I've got nothing to base my time I'm against. Very um, but a I'm assuming I'm doing all right. Ooh, okay, there's the end. That felt good. 206 felt pretty good. Yeah, like, that's... That's solid. <laughs> that's a solid time. All right, well, thank you very much. Uh, Treasure Planet, I'm assuming it's the same as before. It sure is. Theme Hospital, I'm assuming it's the same as the other... The, the game we saw. Yeah, it's the same. Okay. Siphon Filter 2. I'm Again, I'm assuming it's the same as what we've played in the past. Probably. Yep. Train. Yeah, we've played this. Um, Mr. Driller. Have we played this? Yes! This game's rad. I still want to play it more of it. Uh, but we have played it. Jinx! Is it the same as the previous one? Uh, let's find out. What are the levels? Uh... I think, actually, these are two different levels. I might be wrong. Um, I don't remember it being called Mamu City. So I think this is different. I'll find out. May as well look. It'd be silly not to. It is different. And it's got more of that tr traditional Toy Story racer music that we love to hear so much. Yes. I will bring the cannon as close to the wall as possible. Um, yes, I was gonna say, can I, can I read the thing? Uh, eventually. Warning, this wall is scheduled for demolition by order of his majesty the king. But yeah, I, I do kind of want to play this. Because I'm intrigued. To fire the cannon, first touch it and then press triangle. So it's first, that's the line of fire. First touch it. Stroke the cannon, then press triangle. There you go, done. To get out of the way, so probably should just just in case it does, like the cannon did launch back a bit. It didn't, but it could have. What does this one say? Welcome, Jinx. Here with the controls. Jump, tap again mid air for jump attack, swipe attack, special item. Oh, parade! This includes talk driver, on to rotate camera, inventory, freebie look, pause menu, enjoy. That's kind of neat. I do appreciate this game. Like, I like what it's doing. Oh, that is actually pretty effective. Can I break this? Um. Yeah, it does sound quite Treasure Planet. It, like, if you've heard the Toy Story Racer soundtrack, it just does sound like that. It's just, they all sound the same. I genuinely want to make a, a video on, on all of their music because, like, I want to listen to all their soundtracks and be like, okay, what samples have you reused in each game? Like, <laughs> this, 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 and this. Then in fact, the shooting press triangle to roll into the beach ball. To roll the beach ball, sorry. Not into. You're not turning into a beach ball. This isn't some kind of crazy game. It could be, but it isn't. Oh. Oh, I see. I mean, I didn't really do anything. I just went near it and pressed triangle. But, but thank you. But yeah, the uh, the level where I uh, died, like the the dark castle level, that that level seemed quite late game. Like judging from like how easy this one is and how easy the first one was that we played last time. So it's actually quite interesting that they did go with that direction for the demo. They were they were bold enough to be like, yeah, no, we'll give you something hard, which is good. Going for a, a challenging level is actually good. Whoa, okay. Um, this is intense. Ah! Oh my god. Um, yeah, going for a changing level is actually a good idea, because, like, it gives... Well, okay, no. It, it is a good idea, but it's also a ballsy idea, because it gives people an idea of, like, what the difficulty can be, but it also might put people off. If they think, oh, this is level two, then they're just going to be put off by the game, right? So it's it, it, it's it's got its pluses and it's got its negatives. Um, so, yeah, it's quite interesting, but I'm glad that we are... Playing a demo that, uh, that respects my time and actually gives me multiple levels. They didn't have to give me multiple levels. Um, there we go. We've used key. Wee! I missed things. I would like to not miss things. Thank you. Whoa. There we go. Nice. Ooh. 
go checkpoint. Honestly, for like a, an early game level, it might even be exclusive for the demo, but probably not. Like, it's pretty solid. Oh, I missed a star. Oh, I didn't want to miss a star, but I have, and I feel bad about it. Okay, the platform does respawn. I, I do want that star, because I feel like I've got them all so far, and like, that, that small part of me that craves completion, even though it means literally nothing in a demo, is taking over my brain, so... You did it, you beat the demo now, okay, there's more. Um, some heavy objects may be pushed. Wow, crazy. Thank you very much for the advice. So, I guess I want to push you into into the place. Um, and it's quite easy what and obvious what to do. But then again, this is early game level, so I'm not going to judge. Um, I'm okay with it being quite obvious. I wonder how many stars are in the level. Or if, like... We don't yet know if there are, like, a flat 100 or whatever. It might be, like, a random, arbitrary, infinite number. Um, but I kind of want to get them all. I'm, I'm, on, I'm on my way to it, so... Okay. Watch out as you go down this path. Are you ready to run? <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm ready. Go on. Uh, at, at what point does Boulder... Boulder comes after me now. It wouldn't let me move straight away, so I was scared. Oh, I've got more than 100 stars. Oh, some of these stars give you 10. Eh, I didn't actually realise that straight away. This is kind of neat. Yeah! Okay, I kind of love this. It's pretty cool. Yeah, I was confused at first because I couldn't move straight away. It was like waiting for the like thing to start moving. So like I was just like, oh, has my down button not worked? Um <laughs> but no, it was uh it was just more. You must uh you must endure. You must endure. You just you just must endure. Let's screw that star. Oh no! Spikes. You know how I was going for all the stars, I changed my mind suddenly. You sure you wanna teleport? Y yes, <laughs> I think so. I don't know where I am. Oh. What did that do for me? That's a great question. What did that do for me? If I'm supposed to have gleaned something from this, um, I don't know what it is. Oh no! Uh, what do I think the story's about? I have not a single clue. It's probably going to be something like... Jinx is a court jester, and his girlfriend has been kidnapped by Evil King or something. Okay, I'm unsure what the game wants from me, because I've, I've walked like five centimeters backwards, and it, there's no other path to go down. Um, so, that's fun. Unless I can go back through here. Oh, I can! Do I want to, though? I don't know. Don't know if I want to go this way. I guess I'm not going to be crushed. But like, there was nothing else up here, right? Seemingly not. This game's weird. The level design is weird. Like, where do I go? It can't be just go back. The level design is so weird. Cause like there's nowhere else to go. And if I just go, I can go backwards. I don't know if it yields any results though. Like, not really. I'm just back to the beginning. All right. Well, I'm gonna load and I'm gonna. Oh wait. Did I make a safe state there? Apparently I did. Um. Well, I guess we'll have to reset in a minute. Um. What's the other level? Oh, this is the level we played. Yeah, this is the other level we played uh, in the last level. Okay, so it's given us the same demo. Okay. Um, let's reset then, because I accidentally made a save state in the worst place. Uh, to be fair, we were near the end. Um, I'm assuming that this is the same stuff. It sure is. And Cool Borders 3, uh, I think we played? Um, I wasn't good at it, I'm pretty sure. 
Alright, let's see if I can nail it. I did a trick next to someone. How do I how do I do a jump? How does one do a jump? I don't know, but I'm not last, so that's a plus, I guess. Yeah, I'm in fact first somehow. Somehow being accurate. Okay, so that does that. Ah, trees, be careful, trees. I like how I can. T <laughs> That's such a loud slap noise. So unnecessary. Whew. Oh man, I'm I'm really trying here. I'm not usually very good at these games, but I am giving it my all. I'm not getting many points, but I'm giving it my all. I don't really know how to jump, though, I'll be honest. I am trying. Oh, no. I didn't really lose too much, though. That's good. Oh, there we go. Okay. I've... I've okay, so it is just X. It is just hold X. I was trying that before, and it wasn't working, but okay. Never mind. It's fine. Okay. Oh, okay. There is, like, a reason why it wasn't working. Okay, so under certain conditions, your power thing doesn't charge up, if you're like a pixel off the, the ground for whatever reason, like you're, you're, you've are you're just come off of like a small bump of snow, the, uh, the, the power doesn't kick in. That's quite annoying. No, no, I was winning. No, don't do this. I'm gonna lose, aren't I? Well, I'm not last. Come on, I can catch up, right? Probably not, but I, I can try. I need them to screw up, is what I need. Like, if you can, like, kill yourself in a tree or something, that'd be great. <laughs> like, I'm not asking much, just for the world, you know. Yeah! I was not last! <laughs> you know what? I'll take it. <laughs> it is probably the best I've ever done. I'm okay with that. <laughs> so uh, yeah, I think that's uh, that's demo ninety four. That was alright. That was a demo.